Hi, Zach Pater here, River Valley Marine in Red Wing, Minnesota. Wanted to take you through a neat little boat today. This here is an E16 Element from Bayliner. If you're looking for a very easy to trailer compact package that really has a does it all attitude from fishing, water sports, or just general cruising, take a look at this boat. This is a budget friendly way to get into a very nice setup. Start right out here at the outside of the boat and you're gonna see that Minn Kota trolling motor simply slides on and off. You got nice cleats on the side, that black hull. It is packaged with the trailer. The trailer does have a folding tongue on it, which is nice. Work your way down the sides. You have the element graphics, kind of the blue burst there, if you will. Work your way to the back of the boat, and it's kind of nice the way they uh, really extended the platform out on each side. And then here on the starboard side, you actually have the ladder. Ski pylon, or tow bar, I should say. It does have a Mercury 75 horse four stroke on it. Good balance between efficiency and performance. And from there, let's take a look on the inside of the boat. You certainly step on board and I can assure you it does not feel like a 16 foot boat. The amount of seating is, uh, it's amazing. It's a very spacious boat, very unique layout. It kind of has that crossover style between a open bow or a bow rider and maybe even a pontoon. As you can imagine, being a 2021, the seating is all in very, very nice shape. Nice uh, driver's seat here. I like how they do the back. It's kind of a nice little layout area. The center cushion can be removed to be more of a U-shaped seating area. Simply remove the seat. You've got more of a U-shaped seating area and a little bit more walk around space inside the boat. Work your way back over here to the port side and you'll see you've got these very cool kind of side seats with the cup holders and the grab rails. You also got a stereo speaker there. Work your way over to the other side of the dash and you do have rod holders along the stereo head unit and some storage. Work our way over by the dash. It's very clean and crisp, very simple. Stereo speaker down below, capacity plate there, the Lowrance. Uh, it's got the Lowrance Hook 4X on it, nice little depth finder. Uh, which is great as this is kind of a crossover fishing boat. Work our way forward and you've got a nice big broad bow section. Again, the seats are in very nice shape, storage under the seats, cup holders, trolling motor again, the Minn Kota there. And the front of this boat can actually be totally set up to be more of a fishing boat as you can put the pedestal seat in uh, with the filler. Simply slide out the cushions, put in the filler, slide in the chair, now you have a big casting platform in the front with a nice chair. Just a very cool and easy way to transform this boat from a pleasure boat to a fishing boat. And if you're looking for a little additional casting platform space, the center cushion can slide out along with the cushion over top of the filler for the back. Gives you kind of a nice casting platform in the back of the boat as well. And that there is a quick little video walk around of the E16 Element from Bayliner. A good looking package. Again, I am Zach Pater here at River Valley Marine in Red Wing, Minnesota. And I'd be glad to answer any questions you have on the boat or set up a time to view. Thank you again for watching and have a great day.